Welcome back, my friends of the show that never ends and glad you could attend. Come inside today. I've got an independent horror film for you, and it's called Raymond Did It, brought to us by director, writer Travis Legg. And a big a leggy, uh, if I mispronounce that, I do apologize. You know how I am with names. I, I am horrible with these things. Anyway, Travis gives us the story of Raymond, who is kind of a, a, a simpler kid. He's hanging out with some other kids, and he's accused of murdering his brother. Well, we jump ahead 10 years after that incident, and we come to find out that, uh, well, he was kind of set up, all right? And Raymond escapes from the institute that he was in, and he's come back for revenge. Yes, this does have a lot of elements to it similar to Halloween in the fact that you've got a crazy guy bringing, breaking out of the institution and coming back and, and causing some damage to those who may have wronged him uh, in town. Uh, but I really enjoyed this uh, a lot. First off, I, I liked how they worked within their budget on this film. This is a micro-budget, low-budget film, but what they did with it was really well done. The production design of it looked good. I liked the look of it. Uh, the, the the visuals that they had, the night shots, yes, we have the brighter lights in the night shots, but they do give a little bit of a source where that light could come from, and, and you could kind of look past that because I was really into this story, uh, and maybe it was because of the performances of the actors and actresses in here. You get a great group of people who really do well in their performances. Linda, a uh, see uh, Selick, uh, who played uh, Mrs. Rourke, the mom of Raymond. Uh, you got Alyssa Downing in here, who we saw in O.C. Babes and the Slasher of Zombie Town, as well as many other films. She plays the uh, very uh, planning and plotting page. Uh, you've got Lindsay Felton in here as Tammy. You got Jake Skiba as Edgar in here. Just a group of great people. Kyle Hoskins, he does great as the Raymond character. I really enjoyed his character. This is a slasher character, and, and he did really well of, of making this a little bit a uh, unique type of guy uh, and I really liked his character and uh, you could actually feel some sympathy for him too which helps connect to the character and you can kind of see the motivation behind him uh, again there's some fantastic uh, performances in here and some decent gore effects too there's not a huge amount but where they are you get creative deaths in here a la 80s okay you don't have just simple old hack and slash no good old Raymond really gives it to these folks in creative and interesting ways, which uh, is always entertaining for a slasher film. They definitely went the entertainment route rather than a little more serious, darker uh, elements, though those are in here. The deaths, though, if you're any fan of a slasher films uh, that you see, you'll, you'll love the creative ways Raymond decides to off these people. Uh, another great the performance by Lindsay Felton was fantastic, and Alyssa Dowling. Uh, those two really helped steal the show in some scenes, really loved their performances. In general, the story was well done. Again, they knew what type of budget they had and they worked within it. They didn't try to go over the top, do too much, or try to take it in a direction that may not have fit uh, the type of film that they were shooting. So I really enjoyed everything about Raymond Did It. And you know what's great? You can catch Raymond Did It too. I'll put the link down below. I believe it's on Popcorn Flicks, the name of it is called. I'll put the link down below. I want you to go and watch this. If you're a fan of slasher films and indie slasher films, go and check it out and leave comments down below. Let me know what you thought of the film, uh, if you liked it, if you didn't like it, what you liked about it, uh, because I really enjoyed this film. I, it was better than expected and uh, I really look forward to seeing some other works from uh, Travis in this uh, because uh, if they're anything like Raymond did it, uh, definitely are entertaining films and this one is that. So check out Raymond did it for all you slasher fans out there, fans of indie horror films or a fan of just a fun uh, horror film in general, you should check this film out. And that'll about do it for us here at the Final Cut. Till next time, keep that ticket stop.